Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. My name is Seth, and today's public service announcement is dedicated to energy consumption. This program is brought to you by The Salvation Project. So, as we previously stated, energy consumption is an extremely important issue. However, sometimes we have to ignore it to protect ourselves from the evils of the world. Jesus Christ, how dumb As is you that? all know, Satanism has started to rapidly grow in our communities. Since our last program, many of our viewers relate to us their successes of protecting their house from the devil's propaganda. Okay. But that is not enough. As Jeremiah 29.11 says, oh, wow. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans for welfare and not for evil, to give you a future and a hope. So yeah, guys, anyways, welcome to the Salvation Project 10. Last time we saw how we're going to talk about demons and the fear of demons. So it's a continuation of this, you know. We've successfully saved our son, dude. Like, we've burnt all the Metallica, like, posters and all those demonic freaking relics. So yeah, I'm pretty excited how this is going to go. <laughs> the devil comes at the devil's hour. But using science, our specialists discovered that the correct time of the devil's hour is 8 p.m. The devil fears the light. Even the smallest darkness can bring the devil. So we shall shine the light on it and bring safety to our homes. We implore you, turn on every light in your home until 8 p.m. and make your house safer. The devil shall not pass. Be careful, because if you don't care, they will. This was a Salvation Project program. Until the next time, Seth out. I'm, I'm so glad that Seth out wasn't even complete because <laughs> talking about efficiency in the world, human resource scarcity, and we have this bullshit. Oh no, it's almost 8 p.m. I should do something before it's too late. I have to turn on the lights in the places where we sleep so the devil does not invade us when we are not awake. <laughs> Jesus Christ, man, my son, he's a growing child, man. He needs protection for the Satan. But the corridors are equally important, so I should probably light them too. Wait, what? Okay, Jesus Christ, you know, just, just let's just speed run this thing. I'm just gonna speed run it pretty fast. I'm expecting, you know, some good, like, scary things. Scary shit. Wait, I... What's happening? Oh, are you kidding me? This game is... It's it's weird. Okay, let's go, let's go light everything, guys. Holy shit, man. The devil is waiting us in the dark. I wonder how the other gameplays are likely to be unique. You know what I mean? Maybe there's like freaking huge as giant spiders this mother is trying to protect from. Like there's mutatious beings. I don't know. <laughs> it's a weird game. I'll be honest. But I kind of like it. I like the charm. So we had to go here. We had to just turn on the lights and all. Let me just speed run this. Um, How do I turn off the... Jesus Christ. Wait, should I like look up at it or something? Like, should I look at a particular angle? You know what? Frick this. I'll just come back later. Frick this. <laughs> so I should go to the corridor and light them up. Oh, wait. Did the screen just flash? Okay. See, that actually popped up. So I think I can't actually turn them like on or something. Oh, nice. Wait, am I hearing something? I feel like I'm hearing something. Yeah, I feel like I'm hearing something. Oh wait, that's my son's... Wait, what is this? Okay, this is our room. Okay. Ooh, this place is creepy, dude. What is that? That's the husband's photo. Oh wait, I can collect it. Wait, do I like have like an inventory? Press Alt plus F4 to exit the game. No, that's not what I want to do. Um... I wish I could like continue this game that's like a save file. That would be dope, but let's see what happens. Uh, I don't really need to go to the bathroom. Yeah, that's my son's room, right? Yeah, that's my son's room. Like, where is my son? I'm confused. Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh no, I think the power went out because of the overload. I should go down to the garage and restart the power. You know what? I have a feeling that she's gonna create a trouble that didn't exist. Oh no. I hate 
vitesse. Euh... Non, 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 non. Oh, le shit. Non, vu. Tout le shit that got me. That fucking got me. Dude, I'm scared. I'm scared. Holy shit. I am freaking scared. Oh no 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 bro this is scary. It just became scary dude. Jesus Christ. I feel like the demons are quite unique. I think I almost died. It was so dark. And something definitely was in there. Good thing I managed to bring the light back to my house. You know what? I think I was wrong. I judged this mother too fast. I should go and rest. Wait. Uh you sure buddy? You don't want to take a weapon or something? I guess. Oh yeah. Okay, everything's on. Nice. So wait, should I like turn on the lights in places? I'm afraid to go outside. What if there are demons? So wait, like there are actual demons in this game? I think I was too quick to judge, you know? <laughs> Being honest. Ooh, this is creepy. Okay, I think I'm done with everything. Oh yeah. Uh uh Bro what? Well hello there, Mrs. Uh, I believe you found yourself in a bit of a situation. Uh what uh, what, uh why are you here? How did it get inside? Why? Mrs. this is an emergency. And a big one I might say. I uh, came here to help you get rid of the demons in your home. Uh, I see you've been watching my programs, and following them. And you have correctly identified <laughs> that Satan is the root of all problems. Satan is very much real, and is nearing yeah, your home. Yeah, definitely notice the signs. Perhaps pretty, you pretty obvious the signs, signs already. The lights, your son's behavior, and however more that you don't notice. <sighs> and I am here to help you with the protection yeah, of I, your I home. Yeah, I trust you. I trust you. Yeah, equally as fucking terrifying <laughs> as the Satan just came to my home. Okay, but why me? Isn't everyone in danger? Silly, why help me in particular? I am helping everyone. I've already what? helped countless people, and you are just another lucky child of God <laughs> who gets the special treatment. Treatment. But hush now. It was... it was hard for your nerves today already. <laughs> Sounds like some. Go to sleep home. now. <laughs> I will guard it with my life. After you wake video. up, there is much to be done. <laughs> Jesus, what? Dude, how would you let someone? S how do you sleep in a house where you would let someone like that in your home? Welcome this game is pretty everyone. weird. I like it. My name Ouch. is Seth, this is and in today's my public service announcement is dedicated to the signs of Satan in your house. Now, sign number one: Satan himself walks in your home. <laughs> this program is brought to you by the Salvation Project. As you should know, the devil is coming! And we should all be protecting ourselves and our loved ones from the devil. Check your windows! Check your windows! Board them up! Board them up! Satan shall not pass! Check your crosses! Make sure they are not inverted! Check your mirrors! Cover them up! Satan shall not pass! Satan shall not pass! Be careful, because if you don't care, they will. This was a Salvation Project program. Until next time, set out. Set out. Jesus. No mind. <laughs> I like this game. It's pretty weird though. Jesus Christ. Uh. Ooh. Why are you here? What a charmer, huh? Sure is an energetic fella. <laughs> That's true, self. But he is right. Claim you should get on your fella. feet and start covering them windows. Maybe check your garage for instruments and materials. You're bound to have okay. something. I also so remember you having a cross in here nearby, as well as a mirror in your room. So what are you waiting for? Go, go, go! Go, go, go! <laughs> Jesus Christ! I'm like a seal SWAT team or some shit, whatever. Okay, let me just find the mirror. The cross and something's in the garage. First, let me find the mirror. I think the mirror is up. 